Baltimore City has approved a $250,000 settlement in a case involving claims police officers erase cell phone video of an arrest. 11 News reporter Barry Sims is live at Pimlico Racecourse in Baltimore. And Barry, the incident happened there back in 2010, correct? That's right. It happened during the Preakness in May 2010. Christopher Sharp says that he hasn't been back here since, but now he is considering coming back. Originally, I asked for an apology. Nearly four years after a situation at Pimlico Racecourse involving Baltimore City police officers, Christopher Sharp received a written apology framed with a picture by 11-year-old Karina Lawfer of the Statue of Liberty holding a cell phone. He also got a handshake from Commissioner Anthony Batts, who says his department has a new policy on the rights of citizens who videotape police activity. We're getting it wrong, and we have been getting it wrong. Today, we proudly renew our commitment to constitutional policing. How many times you get a puncher? How many times you get a puncher? The video you are seeing is of police arresting a woman at Pimlico during the 2010 Preakness. It was posted on YouTube. Sharp claims he also recorded what happened on his cell phone. Several officers ordered him to surrender his video. He refused. Another officer asked to review and copy it for evidence, but erased it and deleted 20 other personal videos. He says after filing a complaint, police made personal attacks trying to intimidate and discredit him. A federal judge called it a veritable witch hunt. Hitting really below the belt, in my opinion. Um, that was really hard also. I, I don't understand why you do that to someone. The city reached a $250,000 settlement with Sharp and the ACLU. He will receive 25000 The rest pays attorney fees and settlement costs. The city board of estimates approved the payment. <laughs> The citizens have the right to film us. They have the right to videotape us. They have a right to watch us. We carry guns, which have the right to take human life. We have the right to arrest people. We are held to a higher standard and will be kept at a higher standard. To enforce the new policy, officers and supervisors are required to report violations. Sharp says what happened disturbed him, and so did the efforts to find dirt on him. It made me more determined. And Sharp says that the police department is changing slowly. Reporting live from Pimlico, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV, 11 News.